Hey everybody, it's Ori from Astral Web, and I'm here to create this quick video just to show you how to fix your 404s and your broken links on your website. Uh, very, very simply, uh, one of the tools we use aside from Webmaster Tools, a tool to help us uh, find broken links in real time just to go over the, the website, is the Xeno's Link Sleuth, and I hope I'm saying that pronouncing that correctly, but uh, basically if you don't have it or if you haven't seen it, um, basically type in Google Xenu and you'll find it. The website is a little irregular, home.snafu.de, Tillman. Uh, download it, check it out, and see what other people um, you know say about this, uh, but I just want to show you really quickly how to use it. Okay, so let's say you have your website. Um, so I basically downloaded it for Windows, I installed it, and you have this very simple UI, right? So you want to go to File, and you want to click on Check URL, okay? And just type in your actual website. So let's do ours and see what we can correct on our own website, okay? Um, so basically, you type in the domain here, and you can uh, just do a few quick things. So one is you can uh, uh, check external links, so if your website links to you know other domains you can do that too you can inc exclude specific URLs or, ex or include or exclude um, so for example let me give you an example here um, maybe I want to exclude the uh, all the blog pages right sorry so I would do something like that and then I click on add and then it, it wouldn't continue on the links from page to page w with the uh, links that have are in the blog directory, right? So let's just add everything, uh, and I'm gonna just click on OK. There's also other other options to do, but just want to show you quickly, okay? Let's click OK, and you're gonna see right here that it's kind of threading and it's checking all the URLs, showing you the percentage. And once it finds uh, information, it's gonna give you in a list just row by row, which you can also see in the HTML page. You can export it and uh, just say uh, work on it. So let's wait a few more seconds and um, see what it found, finds. I think last time we checked we definitely had some uh, URLs to correct so uh, I hope it finds a few things so I can show you and we can talk about a little bit and then of course we have to fix our, our uh, broken links on our website. Okay, So if you see right here they have the um, you know percentage uh, completed and it'll just go URL by URL so we don't have too many pages most of them are really uh, our blog so it has you know all these kind of redundant pages tag pages category stuff like that should probably finish pretty soon um, let's see so you can also just want to show you in the meantime if it'll let me um, you can also check a list right so instead of just typing in a domain name you can give it a list of of different um, as far as I remember, as different, uh, you know, uh, specific pages to check, and uh, just go from there. So, uh, basically, it finished here, and it says "Link Sleuth finished." Do you want a report? Let's click on yes. Um, let's go here and see. You can upload it to your FTP as well. And uh, here's our report. So, actually. Um, we had zero broken links report. It's kind of surprising. So I guess we, we have fixed it in the in the past. Um, so basically, the, it, the the application goes page by page, follows all the links, and continues on and on. Um, there is a list here of redirected URLs, but a 301 stuff like that. But actually, you know, everything looks pretty good. So um, let me show you another website. Let's try to figure out one that we can find one fairly quickly, right? So I want to show you an example here. So it's actually good for us. Um, let's go here and let's take a look at, let's say, this other website, okay? And um, let's exclude the blog, see if we can find anything, okay? And let's click here. So this should really take a few seconds. Okay, perfect. Okay, so uh, basically, a, what it found here was a list of, sorry, uh, just images that that were linked to somehow in one of the, some of the pages that it don't exist. So all of these are images that we can either delete the reference. So when you look at the report, let me show you how it looks. Right here, right. It'll say here. Um, 
and obviously it didn't check the blog. So if you go down here, broken links ordered by link, you'll see it, it, this blank dot gif is missing, and you'll see where it's missing from, right? So it's missing from this CSS file, jQuery fancy box, jQuery, jQuery, gallery.php, and this one. So basically we have seven broken links really on this CSS uh, file, which is this, a, a, this CSS file, and this uh, PHP file. So there's three references that we would go in our FTP and just delete th those uh, references and run the application again. If everything works, we're good to go. So uh, hope, hope that helped you uh, kind of understand a little bit better about this application. Very nice. Uh, you know, appreciate whoever created that and really, really helpful. So uh, thank you for listening to this video and we'll be happy to help answer with any uh, questions you may have. Thank you.